Construction on the west side of Bryan is everywhere you look, and with new development popping up left and right, that means more customers for the city of Bryan to serve. This plan is the first step in that phase in that development to help ensure that Bryan can meet the needs of its customers, its residents, um, potential customers. In an effort to keep up with the growing demands of Bryan, the city is opening its first new wastewater treatment plant in more than 50 years. It's going to give needed capacity to our west side, uh, serving our residential community, also the bio corridor, Texas A&M Health Science Center. We have to keep pace with those things and the growth that's on the west side, and this plant's going to be the one to do it. The $18 million, 100-acre Thompson's Creek wastewater plant will treat around 2 million gallons every day, but has capabilities of treating 8 million gallons if needed. As industry comes in, residential rooftops come in, we can easily transition to continue to build this plant up to meet the needs of the west side. All while being the most energy efficient plant in the city. So we're taking advantage of slope. So as water comes in, we get to limit the amount of pumps and motors that we need to pick, the, pick up the water and move it out the plant. The new plant began operating Tuesday morning, and the city says they plan to demolish the old Turkey Creek plant within the next few months. In Bryan, Lauren Holman reporting.